Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Unto the Breach, my Malfo series, and I'm here with Jason again. Hi guys. And we are going to play 50 Soul Stones Resurrectionists Against Neverborn. Um, so we are going to get ready, uh, show you the table, we're going to flip some strategies and schemes, show you the pool of models we're pulling from, and then get started. So here's our 3x3 table set up for the quarantine zone style scenery. Um, I have it on an XLS game board, so it's a 9x9 tiles. doesn't work great for every game, but it works great for Malfo because it's a 3x3 board. Uh, we've filled up one side about a third with terrain. It looks good for a ruined part of the city, um, which would make sense because there's obviously resurrectionists and evil Neverborn lurking there. So we're going to place and define some terrain, and we'll be back in one second. All right, so here we are with our terrain set up. We've got a couple of open and ruined structures over here, some closed up ones, um, lots of blocking terrain, some uh, impeding stuff, some rubble and ruins, and a few walls, lots of piles of crates as well. So it's going to be an interesting and dynamic board. Bouncing factions, obviously you're playing Resurrectionists, and I'm playing Neverborn, which we already said. Uh, we've determined deployment with a flip, and it's going to be corners. So 12 inches from the corner, uh, and then it goes out in a bubble, basically, to deploy your models in. Finally, we have strategies and available schemes. So flipping first for strategy, we're gonna get a Raven, a Reckoning, which is remove two models per turn, get a VP. Uh, and then we flip, and it's going to be Tomes, Ravens, twos, and 12. All right, so after looking at the schemes, we're gonna now hire and reveal crews, and we'll be back with that in a second. All right, so we've got Seamus leading the crew. What else did you take? I've got Madam Sybil, I've got a Canine Remains, three Rotten Bells, and two Punk Zombies. Cool, and then what we got in the bag of tools? I got Bag of Tools, Sinister Reputation, and Red Chapel Killer. And Bleeding Tongue on Madame Sabelle. And Not Too Banged Up. Not Too Banged Up. She's still good. So there it is, 50 Soulstone crew for Resurrectionists. On my side, I took Lucius with Secret Assets. He's got his little sniper gun and then Surprisingly Loyal, so that I can include some Guild Guard because I'm declaring him as Neverborn. Uh, he's got the Scribe, um, which is his totem. He's got Guild Guard, Guild Guard, and then Guild Lawyer and Dacial as his surprisingly loyal four-man posse. I would rather have uh, Guild uh, Marksman, but I don't have the models yet because they work way better with this combo, but still. Why not? I'll take what I have. Two Illuminated and Depleted make up the last of my ranks. So there is 50 Soul Stones and Neverborn. With Reckoning as the strategy, both of us have chosen to reveal Outflank as the scheme. So we're now going to shuffle, draw our hands, flip for deployment. Actually, sorry, we'll flip for deployment now, and then we'll shuffle and do our hands. So flipping for deployment, 7 to 11. So you win, so you can choose zones. I will take this corner here. That corner over there. Okay, sounds good. And we will deploy. You'll deploy first, I'll deploy second, and then we'll shuffle and right, get so here's my deployment. I've got an Illuminated. I've got Guild Guards with Dacial, Lawyer, Lucius, and the Scribe hanging out over here. And then I have a Depleted and another um, Illuminated on the flank. Across from me, two Punk Zombies. We have in back uh, the man himself, Mr. Seamus, and then the Line of Bells with a Miss Sabelle and Rotten Canine Remains. Uh, so we're going to flip now for, well, so actually, sorry, we're going to shuffle our discards, draw hands, and then flip first. Right. With our hands drawn and handily put to one side, uh, we can now flip for initiative. I get a ace. Two. Two. All right, so you're definitely winning. Uh, I could burn a soul stone, but I've only got six, so I'm not going to bother. So it goes over to you. All right, I'm going to start by activating Seamus. And he is going to back alley. Casting it. Casting it. 10 will do. So it's within 16 instead of 10. That's nice. So you can back alley way up. Bam. So he's back alley done. He's got two actions left. I will back alley again. Okay, I have the line to set you now. Oh, never mind, I won't back alley again. And... You should move. Uh, he will move four. Here. He's happy right there. He's going to use his last action to focus. Okay, so we are going to start by activating this guild guard. Um, they're within six of Dacial, so he is going to take a um, focus action. Forget it's a zero action, because Dacial's there. And then he's going to move four inches up to here. And take a shot, 12 inches against Shinja Dacial. So unfortunately he's not going to get the bonus from that. Because um, Dacial needs to be within 12 inches of the target. Uh, but that gives me a plus flip. I'll discard my focus for my shot. So I get two flips. Uh, that's going to get rid of the minus flip for you being in cover. So it's just a straight flip. So shoot four. I get a 16. I get a 15. So you can cheat first. Cheat with a 13. So you're at a 16 now. That's going to beat me. And I'm at a 16, which is why you're going to miss. Over to you. 
All right, I'm going to start by activating the dog, who is going to move, move, 12. So he's going to get right up behind this building. Okay, here it comes. And I will use that to chain activate a bell. Did he end his activation within six? In six, not starting six, unfortunately, for companion. All right, so that's going to be the end of that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, so I'm going to activate Dejal next. He is going to... So his walk action is going to be five. He'll walk up next to the skilled guard. Uh, and he'll take a shot at Seamus Six. Well. So let's see what we flip. I get a 17. You get a 13, which is a cheat. No, I'll take the damage. Okay. Um, oh, sorry, I'm going to negative flip, though. I actually get a nine. So I'm going to have to... And I can't cheat now. Cause yeah, cause you're in cover. Use watch my back to activate um, this guild guard now, who will also advance up next to Dacial. She will spend a zero action to focus for free, um, and then she is going to shoot using fire fire um, for an additional plus. So plus plus minus one plus for being in cover just gives me a double four. Flip. You flip a thirteen. I'm going to flip a twelve. So I'm currently losing by one, and that's that. Aim is removed, and over to you. Okay, I'm going to activate this bell. Uh, she's within six inches of Sybil, who gives friendly bells plus one walk until the end of activation, if they start within six. So she will walk six. First action. And six up to here. Okay. We're going to activate this illuminated and he's going to move or walk rather five so he'll walk to here and second action he's going to walk again up to here. Uh, I'm now going to activate this bell. She's going to do a move move as well. And that's it. And we know who the outflankers are. Well we're going to activate this uh, He's going to move, move, so move back, and then walk again, five, up to the line, and it's going to be bell on illuminated crime, apparently. Again. Uh, and same thing again. Do a move, move, up to here. Completed are going to go, so uh, we're going to go four on the first move, and then we're going to go four again with our second move. Up to there. All right, I'm going to activate uh, Sybil. She's going to do a move, move. With her walk of five, so... I'm sure she would correct you and say it's pronounced Miss Sibel. <laughs> well, I've the greasy lawyer. He's going to go five inches over to here. And then he is going to use impassioned defense on as a zero action onto... Oh, let's take Captain. So that needs a 12. I have a casting of six. That's an eight. That'll do it. So he now has hard to kill. So we're just going to move again. Move five on this pile right, of stuff. you? Punks. See punks. We're going to do a move move with this punk. The scribe's going to go. Um, he's just a totem, so he's going to go four. And hang up behind this barrel. And then I think he's good where he is. He'll move four again, just to go hang out next to the lawyer. One punk. So the punk's going to move move. Okay, so we are going to activate Lucius, and he is going to walk four inches over to here. And then he's going to use Commanding Presence to order this guild guard to take a one action to fire at willpower. 13 duel. I get plus willpower though for my lawyer being in range. That's a 13, so that's going to pass. Still gaining the plus benefit to fire from uh, Dacial being there. I'll get a double plus, which will give me a straight flip against uh, you in cover. Uh, and do you have to take a terrifying against shooting? Nope, just against melee or if I end a walk inside your range. All right. So straight flip, 10, 14. This is against your... You get 14. 10 14 as well, so you're currently losing, so you cheat first. Um, 11, so now you're winning. Uh, I do not have the ability to cheat higher, so that's again, it. Again, four inches over to, uh, let's just go two and then two more behind this wall. And use commanding presence to get that guild guard to do the oh, exact same duel, thing. plus from the lawyer being there. That's a 10, so oh, I'm going to plus from Dacial. Whoa, weak. Whoa, slightly less weak. So I'm going to cheat with a 10. I'll take it. Okay. Uh, so that's going to be a difference of 14 to 6. 6. So that's a difference of 
eight, so it's just a straight flip. Um, and that's going to be a one, sorry, for the refurbished collier, one, three, four. Uh, but I get halt on there. Red Joker. Okay, so five damage. And you are halted. You're under arrest. Uh, this model must discard a card to take a walk. I will charge. spend a soul stone to Time reduce prevents. that damage. So weak as he goes to four damage. One more walk action. We're going to walk over to here, four inches. And once again, we're going to order uh, her to shoot you. So willpower duel with a plus from the lawyer being nearby. And that's going to be a four and a two. So I'm going to cheat that with an eight or better. I'm going to cheat it with a ten. Make it happen. Because I don't want her to be paralyzed. So it'll go off. And now she gets to make a plus. About basically a straight shoot action against you with a nine. And you get a... Four. So you're losing by five currently. And I'm just going to take that damage. Okay. So it'll be negative flip from the... Uh, Wall and negative flip again from the thing, so it's gonna be three pick the lowest. Uh, lowest is moderate, sorry, lowest is severe, so that's gonna be four damage. Uh, and for another soul zone to reduce that. Okay. Four. So weak, so that's gonna be three. And then Lucius is gonna use his zero action for secret assets to shoot you. Uh, it's 12 inch range, shoot six, two, three, four. Uh, and that's it. And if you were within three inches of a ski marker, you get a plus and it would ignore cover, but I don't. Um, so it's just going to be a straight negative flip because you're in cover. So two, you get one. I can't cheat. I get a total of ten. A total turn of fourteen. For me. And turn for you. So you managed to put some uh, some damage on this guy. Uh, but yeah, I might just get murdered with a, a handgun shot in a second. <laughs> so we'll see. Uh, we're going to shuffle, draw new hands, and see what. Next turn. Is so flipping for initiative. I got three. Ten. I went first. Uh, Seamus is going to go first. Makes sense. Uh, and he's going to get out of there. <laughs> start with a live for the pain shot. Okay. Uh, so it's a one action range ten. Um, cast against defense. Uh, target suffers. Two, three, five damage. Heal this model the amount of damage equal to damage target suffers. Awesome. Who's he shooting? This guy right out in the open the here. Oh man, I'm only defense three, I think. Yeah, my defense is bad. So six. I got a nine. Eighteen. Yeah, you can have her. <laughs> Go for it. Uh, so is that a plus flip? Uh, no, so sorry. Straight. Currently at nine, and you're at what? Eighteen. Yeah. So, straight. so yeah, straight flip, just straight up. So moderate. How much is that? So moderate would be three. Okay, it's hard to wound, so flip another one. So it's going to be weak. Which is two. And I'll take two, two life back into Seamus and two off my depleted. Uh, and I'm going to do it again just because I'm good like that. All right. Defense three. Ace. I got an ace two. Uh, so currently I'm losing. So uh, yeah. what's, your, what's your shoot? Six? Yeah. Mine's three. So I'm going to cheat first and go to a 13. So you're at seven. So you need to get six more points or... To tie. So I'm going to cheat with an 8. So you're at 14 to my 13, so you're up by 1, so it's a negative flip, and a negative flip again, so 3 pick the lowest. Boom! So 2 again. Action. And we're going to go one more time because okay. I don't want to die right now. I get 3, I'm at 6, you're at 13. I'm at 15. 6 to 15, difference in 9, straight flip. I'm going to cheat with a 9, put it to 12. And that gives you a difference of three, so it's a negative flip. So three, pick the lowest. One more. Yeah, because I'm at hard to kill. So that was a three, so it's weak. So two more points, and you heal two. Companioning this bell, who's within six, she gets to go. And she is going to just move up to here. Uh, and she started within Sybil, and then move up to here. So, second verse, same as the first. Let's do the uh, guild guard right here. He's going to activate. He's going to get a free zero action to focus from Mr. Captain Dacial. Uh, and then he is going to spend that focus immediately to shoot. So he'll get plus flip from that, plus flip from Dacial being within 12 in line of sight of uh, Mr. Guy. So it's just a plus flip now because you're in cover. So two. That's going to be a 11. So that's a total of... 15 to your 16. 16, so you're winning, so I'm just going to take it. And he's going to go again, so it's just a regular flip now because he loses his focus. 
I get a 14. I also get a 14. You get the cheat first. I'll take it. Okay, so it's cover. Are you hard to wound? Yes. Impossible wound, so it's negative, negative, negative. Uh, so cover the flip and um, that's so a three pick the lowest, sorry, four pick the lowest. But I flip a red joker. <laughs> so we take the red joker and you will take, because uh, you always take the red joker. Uh, what is it? One plus four is five damage. Five damage. That was pretty good. Um, and now it's over to you. Fight tonight, down in the quarantine zone. All right, going to activate this bell. She is within six of Sybil, so she's going to move 12. All sorts of room to get up to here. We're going to activate Captain Daisha. Now we're going to activate this here, uh, Guild Guard, and it's going to shoot you. So it's going to focus for free and then spend it immediately to shoot. Uh, so it's plus flip because I get minus from the cover. So I get a five. Uh, you get a 16 to my eight. Do I want to cheat? No, I don't. Uh, we're going to go again. So now it's just a straight flip. I get a 17 to your 12. I'll take it. Okay. Uh, 17 to 12 means difference of 5. Can't cheat it higher. Uh, it will be a, um, what is it, halt again. So you are now halted again because uh, of the trigger. And that's going to be negative, negative, and negative. So that's going to be 4 and then pick the lowest. So 1, 2, 3, and 4. So weak. And this going to be 1 damage. Back over. Like the fusillade continues from the guild guards. Maybe if they do good this game, I'll upgrade them to guild uh, riflemen or something. So she's going to come over to Bell's here. Gonna to the she's going to activate. He gets no bonuses to anything, uh, but he will aim. Is he going to focus for one? Yeah, he might as well. He's going to focus for one and then take a shot at you. That means I can cheat it because I'll get your cover. So 12 total for me, 10 for you. Do you want to cheat? Yeah, I'll cheat to a 13. Okay, I will also cheat to a 15 with a mask. Double negative again, so I flip four, pick the lowest. So one, two, three, and four. Lowest of which is an ace, actually black joker. So I'm done, over to you. All right, Sybil's going to take a move, move. Get walk five, so. Gonna move up to here. Gonna activate the guild lawyer. Guild lawyer is going to walk five, just up to oh, let's say here, yeah, like so. Uh, and then he is going to cast special damages onto Sybil. It's gonna cast uh, versus your willpower to resist. Uh, I'm casting six with a book. I flip an 11 with a ram, so that puts me at 17 to willpower. My willpower is 5, which would put me 13. at 13. You can cheat if you want. No, that's alright. Okay, so you are special damages, which means fees. So if you do a damage, what do you? So, zombie. Zombie. Well, just kind of move, move. move. He's unimpeded, so kind of straight across this train. way. Yep. Let's just start with Lucius. He's going to start off by walking this far <laughs> and then using commanding presence to get, oh, let's say this guild guard to shoot you again, or do I want Dacial to shoot you? No, Dacial's not going to ignore cover. So, yeah, this guild guard's going to do it, and he'll use Dacial's ability to fire, or she'll use Dacial's ability to fire. So, willpower test, I get an eight. Ooh, I only get a seven. Failed, so she's paralyzed. So she is now paralyzed. So, his second action, he's going to move again. Uh, he's going to get this skill guard to do it, and hopefully not fail my willpower test. Eight, so I'm going to pass this time. That makes me take a one action. So he's going to shoot with the plus from Dacial, so I can cheat it uh, against your Seamus. Straight flip. I get an 11 for a 15. Get a two. I don't like that. So six, you want to cheat it. Difference of nine. That's going to be 17 to my 15, so nothing Next action. going to just... Dirtle again slightly, and then same thing, commanding presence, so two flips against willpower 13. I flip an 11 and a 9, so I'm good, so I can take a one action. So again, shooting with the unparalyzed guild guard. Let's see what happens. I get a 16 to your 7. Can't beat it. Difference so. in 9, so it'll be, again, four negatives. One, two, three, four.
four, so three negatives rather, because you're hard to impossibleness. And that's gonna be we damage again. Right, and then finally, I'm gonna use hidden assets to sniper shot you again with uh, Mr. Shoot six, and I won't be able to cheat it unless I spend a soul stone, which I will to get myself a plus flip. So it's gonna be a straight flip, and let's see what we get. So it's six against four. I get a 13 for a 17. You get a seven. A seven. Okay, so it's only a difference of 10, so it's just a straight flip. Um, I get a book though, which does nothing. One critical strike though. So I'm gonna, yeah, I'll use the, I'll use the ram that's native to the shot. Actually, sorry, no, I need a ram. Target number 12 and a ram. You can go off, actually. Uh, you still make your defense flip, but I needed a ram in there to actually make it happen. Right, that's him done, so it's over to you. You've got, I think, a punk left. And the dog. Back to get the scribe. Scribey is going to just move over to here. Can I be within range of both? Probably, if I'm standing right there. So I'm going to lock four over to here. And just check that I'm within three of him. I am. I'm within three of him. You. I've got two eliminated and a depleted left. All right. Dog is going to run into the house. Dog is going to dog. Get a walk, so walk, walk six. So you can walk one and walk again. Walk and then defend. Go defensive, yeah. Okay, um, this depleted is gonna activate. He's gonna charge that bell. He has a charge of eight. I shall put him six and two, so just put him right there. And then he has a two inch engagement, which should be more than enough, yeah. So I have a melee of five against your defense of four. I flip an eight for 13. Two. Uh, I'm gonna take it. Okay, so six to 13, it's just a straight damage flip. Moderate, because you're hard to wound. So still moderate, um, and you will be taking four. Attack, I get a 15. You get a 13, so you can cheat if you want. No, I'll take the damage. Okay, so again, uh, negative, negative. Uh, two severes, that's going to be five. She is toast. All right, removed. That's a body marker. Hmm? Corpse. I'm done. Okay, so I have a depleted and one of these guys remaining. So we're gonna do this uh, illuminated. He's gonna advance five over to here. And he is going to take a shot at this bell. So with an eight, for sure. He's so got a gun? Brilliance cloud? Yeah, man, he shoots brilliance at you. It's, it's the dogs with bees in their mouths. They bark, they shoot bees at so you. I got a total of 12 to your five. Yeah. All right, you can cheat? No. Okay, I'm gonna shuffle. All right, so if you look at my damage roll, uh, it's just a straight damage flip. Moderate, and that's going to be, oh, what did I flip? Where are you, Mr. Uh, illuminated? Hard to wound. You should shoot oh, so another I should flip another one, yeah. It's still moderate. And that's going to be scintillating cloud, uh, four damage. And after damaging, I can place a 30 millimeter brilliance marker in base to base, and all models within one inch have brilliance. So, so um, we are going to then activate the depleted. It is drawn to brilliance, and what that means is I can push it towards um, as a zero action, a brilliant model within 12. So I'm going to push it towards the punk zombie, five inches. Before I start to activate, so that's going to be over here. Hey, hey man, I hear you got some stuff in her right there. She's going to charge that bell five inches, which will easily put her within one because she's within six. And be right there. Man, I hear you got some stuff. Hey, you got anything? Are you holding? Four against your defensive four? Yep. You got a nine for a 13. I got a 13, so. So 17. you win. Uh, second attack. 11 for 15. I got a six, so a ten. ten. Difference of five. So we'll take it. Okay, so are you hard to wound? I am hard to wound. So that's going to be negative and then negative again for the difference. So three pick the lowest. We're going to get a weak damage. One. Not quite enough. So we're going to deal and shuffle and go again. That was bottom of two. Neither of us destroying two models this turn, so not ending in any kind of um, victory points. Over to strategy. three. So Jason drawing up his hand to six, deciding to burn a soul stone to draw two extras, and then dealing down. So now we flip for initiative. Let's see who's going first. Ace. Flip. Do I want to reflip? Uh, I think I do. I'm spending a soul stone. Like I only got to beat a four here. Nine. Boom! You gonna do it back? Yeah, you're damn right I am. Go! 
An eight? No, no. You can go again. You can go again. Might burn a soul stone, or you can save him for damage prevention. Yeah, I'll take the damage. No, I. No, I'm going first. Okay. It's mine. You're nine. Ten! No. Soul stone, but Seamus gets to activate first. No. Seamus going first. We are playing the Get the Hell Out of Here game. After maybe sucking back some wounds from killing some guys. Uh, so I'm going to open fire on your lawyer. My lawyer? Slimy, and okay. that's how he's fun. He is a greasy lawyer. I will warn you, though, he's not terrible defense-wise. Seven right now, so you might want to pick a different target. The scribe's easy to hit, and that would actually pull the defense off my guys. It defends four on the scribe. He gets a 12 total. You get a nine. Eight. Eight. So I'm going to cheat that. Uh, you have a what total? Did you spend your focus that you oh, got last no, turn? Flip again. Let's do that. Yeah, there we go. That's better. That's more like it. Now that focus token goes away. This is why focusing last turn was a good deal. Um, so now you have a 12 to my 8. So, sorry, to my... You have a 7... No, 18 to my... 4... 12. So 6 different. So you can cheat that. No, you get a, Yeah, you can cheat that. Do I want to cheat that down? I think I do. I just need to cheat it one more. I'm going to cheat it one more with a tome. Just so it's at a negative flip. And you can cheat higher if you want. If you want to cheat it with 13, you get back to a, you can cheat. Or sorry, back to a not negative flip. Nope. Okay, so you've got a negative two, pick the lowest. Good and medium good. How much is that? So that is three. So three. I'm gonna have one left. Mm-hmm. Gonna go again? I am going to go again. Okay. He's going to also shoot the scribe. That makes sense. But Joker! Oh, that sucks. You hit me. I get a zero four. You get a nine. So difference of five. So it's a negative flip. Which is still two damage. Okay. Uh, it's going to kill me. You only cause one though. So you heal back one. You guys drop down in defense. Back down to six. Last action is going to jump over the box. Hopefully put himself out of... It's wisely pulled him outside the 10 inch range for my guild guards. Meaning that they can't shoot him this turn. So that haven't been done. Now we have to figure out what's next before things start getting messy. Um, I think, I think, I think, I think, we're gonna have to try and kill this bell. Um, so we're just gonna open up with brilliant shots. So this, um, uh, what should we call it? Uh, Illuminate's gonna activate and he is gonna take a scintillating cloud shot into, cause that actually is gone, into. We also realized that uh, Seamus needed to discard a card to walk there cause he had hauling away at the end of the round. So that was fine. It's just fees that didn't expire. So yeah, so scintillating cloud, I am shoot five against your defensive four. I get a 17. Nine. You wanna cheat? Uh, so you're at 13 against 17, difference of four, it's a negative flip right now. I'll just take the negative flip. Okay, so three, it's double negative, so that means that it's three pick the low, so it's gonna be weak, two damage. Uh, and once again, you will be shot one more time. Oh, sorry, and after dealing damage, uh, what did I hit you with? Did I hit you with a mask? No, I hit you with a ram. I shoot you one more time. Ten of masks. And you hit? You gonna cheat? No. Okay, so right now I'm at a 15 against your six, a difference of nine, so it's just a straight but minus one for your hard to wound. You have brilliant, no, you don't have brilliant on right now, never mind. Um, but I will place a marker, so it's gonna be weak again, which is two more damage. So I'll take you out of, but it'll also trigger this, which will make this guy brilliant. As I shoot you with weird spaces, it's gonna get sporty this round. Uh, my zombie punk is going to turn that into a pile of mush. Okay, you do that. <laughs> Katana, and you're flurrying, so I get a defense of four. I'm at sixteen. Uh, six, you got a I'm nine. At 15. No. Yeah, six, fifteen. So you're down by ones. You want to cheat? Uh, I've got two more. I don't want to burn all my cards. Ah, you know what? Yeah. Flip a 12. Yeah, so you're good. You hit me, but it's a negative flip now and negative again because I'm hard to wound. So. One, two, and one more. One more? It's still going to be the aces. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, and that's going to be what damage? So that will be two. Two. That's going to kill me, and I'm consumed. All models have been two, take two damage. So that's going to do two damage to him, and then my... Uh, so it's going to definitely score you a VP at the end of the round because you've just killed two now. So over to me. Who wants to go? Bell is also framed for murder. So you're going to get one VP for that because he's just a general dude, not a henchman or a leader. Um, and you'll get one at the end of the round for your 
Uh, okay, reckon. so that is an over to me, and we are going to activate this guild guard, who's going to advance five, so two, and then four over to here, and then we'll just be happy with that probably. Actually, maybe just go three over like so. And then he is going to take a shot at uh, good old Mr. Uh, Shaman Focus for free. We'll pull that off. Um, and then his shot will gain plus from being within 12 in line of sight of Dacial still. So it's just going to be a single flip. Uh, plus plus. Uh, it becomes just plus because of the minus for you being in cover. So I get two, you get one. You get a five highest. Uh, I have a 17. Okay, well I'm going to cheat with a 13 and make mine a 17 as well. Actually, sorry, I'm going to cheat with this 13 now, because I like rams. Uh, would you like to cheat? Do you have a joker? <laughs> you going to drop it? Nope. <laughs> yeah. He's going to advance over to stand by his side of this fellow. Looks like so. Um, and then he's going to take a pot shot at Seamus with his collier. Shoot six, negative flip though, because of your being in cover. So I picked the lowest of two. I get a 4 to 10, which is my highest. What's your flip? 9. 13, so nothing. Uh, and then I'm going to use Watch My Back just to activate this. Oh, no, sorry. Watch My Back is... Yeah, no, I friend the model can activate within 6. Hmm. I'm actually going to activate uh, Lucius with Lucius is just going to tow the corner this way. So he's going to walk 4. Over to here. Uh, he's used commanding presence to command that guild guard. So I need a plus flip. I need an eight here. I get the red joker, so I'm good with my willpower roll. And then I flip to shoot you again. He'll use Captain Dacial's bonus to ignore the cover. So it's a straight flip. And he's shooting Seamus. So I get an eight, 12. You get a six. I want to cheat. You get a 12, I got a six. So I got to bring that up by eight. Uh, yes. So now you're at 14 to my 12. I'm going to cheat it up to a 15 and 11 in masks. It's going to hit you. I'll uh, so take the hit. Negative, negative, negative. So four pick the lowest. So that's going to be weak again. And yeah. Weak is going to be one damage. Zero action from Lucius to use secret assets to shoot him. Uh, and that means within 12, I'm shoot 6. What's the defense on the punk zombie? He is defense 5. Okay, I need a ram in this. I get a feather. You get a black joker, but I don't Should think you need a 9, because right now it's not going off at all. Uh, you can't cheat because black joker, so your difference of... What's yours with 0? 5? Your total's 5? Uh, yes. My total's 15, so I just get a straight flip to damage. That's going to be severe. He's going to take... Five damage. One actually because of hard wounds. Still severe. So five? Uh, it's going to be five damage. Yeah. One left because of hard to kill. Uh, I will then take another action, and Lucius is going to walk four inches or five inches back to where he was. <laughs> and he's commanding presence to order him to shoot Seamus. So willpower duel again, plus because of the lawyer. I get an 11, which is good. So I get my shot. And it's going to be straight because of the plus from Dacial. Four is eight. Four is eight. You are currently losing. Do you want to cheat? Yeah, I'll cheat. So I'd like to put you in a 10. I'm going to cheat with a 13 to put myself up to a 17. So it's a straight flip for damage, minus 2 because of cover and your crazy abilities. So I'm going to cheat down, or flip it over for a week, which is one more point of damage. All right, and my last one, I'm just going to dirtle, shift slightly, and uh, yeah, do it one more time. So straight flip. Uh, you get you win. You man, there's a lot of bullet. Like I can just imagine the wall is just coming down. <laughs> over here. There's an amazing gunfight happening, but this guy refuses to die. My bell. I'm gonna move her two inches up onto these crates just for fun. Okay, for funsies. You gonna get naked? Uh, and she's gonna cast lure on Dacial. Uh oh. So I'm looking for a cast eight target number twelve. Okay, willpower on Dacial is six. I get a plus to my willpower duels, though, because the lawyer's nearby. Oh, sorry, it's only on horror duels. Oh, it's a toughness or Defense? target number, so... Oh, it's just a spell, okay, yeah. Um, so you get a five, what would you need? That would get it. There's no resist. 
Um, because he wants the suit. Up to a six of crows. Sure. So doesn't look that bad to me. After succeeding, must uh, target must discard a card if able. Okay, so I'll discard my card, and then you lure me. So what's that do? Uh, so Dacial moves his walk uh, as close to the model as possible, and he's in line of sight of Madame Sybil, who has uh, out of my way models targeted by lure action from a friendly bell. Oh, never mind. So just, he moves his walk action towards He's not fitting in between these two guys. I had to go around and fire activate this guy and discard Paralyze the dog and Sybil. What would you like to do? The dog is going to move six around this little stuff. Brings him out to about there. Fighting Dacial. Dacial. Okay, my defense is bad. Five. Um, enemy model receives minus one defense while within one inch of this model. Okay, so I'm defense four. I get a total of nine. Twelve plus um, four, so I'm sixteen. Sixteen, I can't cheat, so you've got a, a total of seven, so you just got a straight damage flip. Moderate, so moderate is three, okay. uh, and you gain one poison for infect. Okay, I'm armor one, so I take two damage, and I will gain a poison. Okay, so last but not least, I have this. Okay, so he's just gonna advance his five, like not all the way, but just hanging out over here, so he can shoot you with some wonderful principle is six. Yes. Okay, I am shoot five. I flip an 11 for a 16. And I will flip an 11. Okay, so you're winning, and I can't to the left. Um, and Civil will activate and charge this guy. I love it. And tell me that Bleeder Lash has got some range. Range of two. You're good. Beautiful. So you get to make a def def uh, defense five, so straight flip. I get a 12 total. Uh, six, so a 13. Okay, so you're going to hit me. I can't cheat. And damage flip. Oh, she's got the tongue. What did I? This ram does nothing. Uh, so damage flip. Go for it. Severe. How much damage is that? Which is five. Armor one goes in. Seven. Uh, I got a one. Can't cheat. So you're gonna hit me with a thirteen to six. Difference of seven. So straight flip for damage. Okay. So that's gonna be a straight flip. Seven. How much damage is that? That would be four. Oh man, oh, I'm discarding two soul stones because I don't have any cards. Never mind, he's actually just dead, so not discarding those soul stones. You take two damage though because of fees, because you've attacked and damaged me twice. Uh, and that was actually my sucker, so I'm gonna reveal and my scheme and get the be frame for murder. Um, and so I'm actually gonna get three VPs for that. But end of round, um, you're going to have scored an additional. Uh, one for Reckoning, because you killed my Scribe, and you also killed that Illuminated. With the two you've already gotten, you're now at three as well. So we're tied. Yeah, Dacia's going to take another damage from the Poison Token. And we'll go so to turn four. We will shuffle. I'm going to put it on my unactivated tokens, and we'll start the All right, with our hands redrawn, we are going to flip four initiative. And both of us Six. really need this. Eleven. Last soul stone. Spend it. Spend it. Yeah, let's do this. Really? You're going to beat an 11? Oh my gosh. Oh, oh with also an 11. All right. All right. For a six. So I get to go first. Let's just check. Okay. We're going to activate Dacial, um, and he is going to charge. Oh, no, I can't charge him when I'm engaged. Or can I? Yeah, we're just going to advance over to here. Like this, maintaining melee. And we're going to swing on this dog. Doggy. You're going to eat it. Here we go. A melee six. I get an 11 total. My defense 5, 12, 17. 17. I'm going to cheat with a 13 up to 18. Okay, I'll take that. All right, 18 to 16, difference of 2, so negative flip and you're hard to kill, so 3 pick the lowest. That's going to be weak, which is 2 damage. Uh, we're going to activate Watch My Back um, to activate Lucius. Lucius is going to advance uh, 2 to here. The walk. Actually, we'll that's two more over to here. <clears throat> so 
So the commanding presence is going to let him fire if he can pass him. Willpower duel with an eight. It's a seven and a four. We're gonna cheat it. With an eight, so it passes Dacial's bonus again to make you not have to be in cover. So straight flip. I get a total of nine. You get a total of 13. Yep. I'm going to cheat it with a 12 up to a 16. I'll match you with a 13. Okay, so that's gonna be a 17 then. So she's gonna going. activate, he's gonna walk again just over to here. Commanding presence on the guild guard. Double flip. You need an eight. Don't get it. I'm gonna cheat with an eight. So straight flip again against you. 12, that's 16. 17. Oh, 17. Goes Zero away. action. We're going to use our, um, our uh, whatchamacallit, secret assets to try and shoot Seamus. Has a shoot value of 6. You're in cover though, so it's negative. Two pick the lowest. I'm going to miss. Um, and then we're going to walk one more time, like so. And Guild Guard's going to shoot you one last time. Straight flip. Red Joker. Bam, you did it. Okay, so that's going to be a 14-16 with a ram, I'm going to call it. And what do you have? Uh, 15. 15. So that's going to be a difference of 1, so it's, again, 4 negatives. But plus 1 damage, so moderate's the lowest. And weak. Oh, two damage. You have 1 left. If I'd gotten that moderate, you'd and have been it if I'd done 1 more damage. Good job, guys. Sure was run! The law is coming! Funsies? What am I going to do? Seamus needs to get... Out of there. <laughs> he does. He also needs to kill some stuff, get some life back. So he's going to move around to the back of this building. Good call. And then back alley. Uh, so that's one back alley. Get it off. And you want to try your try your thing? Oh, that doesn't get off. That gets it off. Good stuff. So ten inch relocate anywhere with blocking stuff. So he's going to go. Oh, he can go right into here. No. I was going to say from cover to cover. Yeah. Get back at it one more time. Back right. alley. I'm pretty sure he can see you. You're only height. So you're height two, right? Oh, never mind. Yeah. We are getting height. just illuminated. And he is just going to focus. He's going to play it safe and move forward. And then he's going to shoot you. I get a total of eight. Twelve. I'm going to cheat with an eleven and put it up to a sixteen. Ooh. So oh. we're both at sixteen then? Oh. Cheer with a 13, okay. Zombie is going to move four to stand up on top of this barrel. Because he's fun like that. And I'm going to cast Slice and Dice, melee five, range three, all models within range must succeed on a toughness 13 duel or suffer three damage. Flip, no. Cheat. I am going to cheat it. And that's difficulty? Uh, it's a difficulty of thir or toughest 13, or sorry, target, target number 13, 13 yep. so it goes off, uh, defense 13 duel. So it's a defense against target number 13, okay. Yeah. So defense on Lucius is 6, and he's uh, 7, 9, he's good. Defense on Dacial is 5, I believe, so he needs a 8, 13, eight. he's good. Uh, this is guild guards, and he is going to charge, like so. So what's your defense? My defense is five. Okay, um, I have the elite cadre ability, sorry, elite training. Friendly models within three get plus 20 melee flips, so I get to flip two, pick the highest. Who has that? Lucius does? Lucius gives that to models within three that are minions. Damn. So I'm gonna flip, I flip a two, that's not very good though. And 13. you flip a 13, that's so gonna totally miss. Go for my second one. I a 10, um, so I get a four, 14. I got a 15. So you, I miss again. You. Oh, and sorry, I should admit, are you terrifying? No. no. It's just uh, Sybil and Mushmane? Yeah. yeah. Get him, dog. Try to bite on Dacial. He's going to bite Dacial a lot. Okay, defense 5 on Dacial. Dacial flips an 11 for 16. 3. Going to miss. Do you want to cheat? I am going to cheat uh, with a red joker. Bah! Okay, so I'm at 16. You're at who is it, 19? Uh, 4. Yeah. So 18, sorry. 18. Difference of two then, so negative flip, flip two, pick the lowest. It can be any suit you want though, so you can prog. <laughs> but it's zero damage because it's Black Joker. But you can still prog your trigger. What's your trigger? Uh, 
You can shoot the trigger is, uh, yeah, it's just poison plus one. Joker effect, but I am poison, so I'll take a damage. Right. Activate this guild guard, lawyer, and he going to charge this dog. How much life does this dog have left? Not a lot, right? <laughs> or do I do the Joker? Okay, first things first, we're going to take a tactical action. We're going to do impassioned defense on... I don't think anyone's going to get charged. Is this bell gone yet? No. No. So we're going to put impassioned defense on Dacial and just give him hard to wound. Four. That's not going to go off. Nope. And we're not going to bother cheating it. And then we are going to, I guess, charge the dog... Or we could put special damages. We are going to put special damages into the punk zombie. I cast on a six. I get a total of 12 on a ram, so it goes off. Oh, um, cast. <laughs> you resist with your willpower. So yeah, flip. And it's seven. What's your willpower? Not good enough. Five, so 12. 12. So it still goes off. Um, and you are now feased, which means you take a damage every time you make an attack. Uh, and then we are going to do the same thing onto your uh, bell over there. So resist with willpower. I need a six. I don't get it. Doesn't even go off. What'd you get? Hey, Action. over to you. Lawyer, your lawyer. My lawyer. All right. He don't care about you. He's seen ten bells like you. It does not go off with a ace foot. My resist is my willpower of six. I would have had a sixteen. You can do it again, and Lure. fail again. Looks no, like I passed. It. You passed just? Yep. Okay, I have a total of nine. What's your total? Uh, it's, it's a target number, so it's just... Oh, oh. so there's no resist. Never no. Mind. no. Sorry. I'm flipping anyway. I thought I'd resist it. But yeah, go. Uh, you lure me. So I am so walk over the guild lawyer, I believe five. Yep, I'm going to walk towards her. Five inches to there. And is he within one inch? Not a chance. No. Far. Lawyer having now gone, I have a guild guard left. I gotta try. I'm gonna go five. And I'm gonna go five again. I just have to do one damage. Just one damage, that's it. Last punk. And uh, then Mount does, Sybil. He's going he's to be on the line, yeah. He's been in line within three inches of the corner. You got it. Oh, lots of room to move. At the end of the turn, uh, you have deleted no models. Dacial's gonna take a damage from the poison. And flip for initiative, it's turn five. Last turn of the game, neither of us earning any VPs right now. Well, Step Joker's out of the way, and we're gonna flip for initiative. This is hugely important, I get a four. Six. I'm gonna spend a reflip. I can't. Six. We both, we flip we both again. reflip again. Nine. Nine, go again. Three. Seven. Damn. Bam. All right, so I'm going first. Okay, Ooh. so this is kind of huge right here. Kind of huge. So this is going to be like the janky assassination run to end all janky assassination runs. And if something doesn't work here, it's going to suck. So we're going to start off with um, Dacial, and he's going to swing on your punk zombie. What's your melee? Or sorry, your defense? My defense on them is five. Melee six. Let's see what I get. Eleven total. So 18 total. Oh, that didn't work. So we're just going to have to cheat. You have 18 total. Well, I'm going to cheat with a ram to put myself at 19. You got it. And plus one damage. So you're at, are you hard to kill? Of course I am. Okay, so I'm at three negatives, but I get plus one damage because of the ram in my total. So even with weak, you're going to take three damage. And he's toast. Yay! Break off from melee with Dacial now. Um, that's my intent. So let's see if I do. What's your uh, melee? You basically make a... We make Did a melee. He, you make a melee attack against me for me to break off. Didn't he spend two? No, nope, that was my first yeah, action. Yeah, cheated. You cheated it. Uh, so you get a seven. What's the melee on the dog? Melee on the dog, I believe, is four or five. Four. So I'm defense five. I'm going to cheat up to a grand total of 18. Yeah, you got it. Okay, so I get to break off. I need to try and get line of sight on this guy. So I'm going to go five inches over to here. I'm just going to put me right there. Well, that plan would have worked. 
No, because I want to see this shit you go You want to see it happen? Okay, so I'm going to move back. I, I, I have I want to. you to fail by screwing up. Yeah, I can't gain line. There's no way for me to gain line of sight here. This this janky thing won't work. I can pre-measure everything anyway. Yeah. So moving right to the maximum melee of, or maximum range of six for watch my back, there's no way I can get line of sight on him. So that part didn't work, but now we're going to use watch my back to activate Lucius. Lucius is going to walk four over to here so you can see this guild guard. And now if this doesn't work, if I paralyze her on the first one, I'm, I'm toast. So I am going to use um, watch my, or sorry, uh, Commanding Presence. I need an 8 here to flip to get to shoot him. I get an 11, so I pass. So here we go. You get shot, you're in cover. So you're, I'm at minus 1, so I flip 2, pick the lowest, and I can't cheat. Ugh, oh. I get nothing. So we're going to do it again with my second action. We're going to go... Oh, could I do something else? Maybe 4 again. And commanding presence, two pick the lowest. I get a two. What do you get? Five. So you win. Okay. <sighs> Last one again. I'm gonna go four over to here. Commanding presence. Here we go. Two pick the lowest. Nine and five. I have a nine total, so I don't Action. cheat. I get to use my. Uh, my hidden asset to try and shoot you. Burn a soul stone for that attack flip to ignore your cover. Um, and that means we're just at a straight flip here for secret asset. Let's see what you get. I'm shooting six. Well, that's not good. But I have nothing to cheat with. Well, yeah, that janky assassination run didn't work, but I managed to kill a punk zombie, which is pretty nice. Um, we need to put a, a corpse counter up there, actually. So, okay. Uh, so, so within 10? Seamus is yeah, definitely within 10. You can try and get some health back here. So defense four, I get a total of bad. I get seven. seven to nine. So you hit me with a difference of two. Yeah. So it's a negative flip. I'll take it. Okay. <laughs> so if that's if you if your two together is more than five, it's seven. I'm dead. Oh. You, get, you get five damage. <laughs> Actually, he's gonna duck away into there, and then he's gonna use um, what's it called? Uh, back alleys. Back alley. He does. So I get the tome, so I got a 16 inch range on that. Okay. Because I want him good and out of here. I guess I probably could have gotten away with the 10. The 10, Whatever. but. My go, I'm going to activate this illuminated. He's going to move two and then two and then one just over here. And he's going to brilliance shot you with some scintillating brilliance. Uh, so I'm shoot five against your defense of. Five. All right, straight flip. You have 15. Eleven. You want to cheat? Yeah, cheat to thirteen. Okay, can't hit. She's gonna jump in here, and she wants a piece of this big old man. Okay. <laughs> Poor uh, So defense five. Uh, teeth and nails. No one likes teeth and nails. I get a fifteen total. I think you miss. Uh, yeah. I'm going to cheat a ten. Cheat a ten. Okay. Well, then you will hit me. Difference of less than six. Yeah. So. Negative flip. One more. Still weak. So that's one damage. Okay. Uh, armor one, so still one. Uh, this fella is just going to. Would you have a two inch melee? No. No? Mm, I'll charge anyway. <laughs> Why not? Uh, melee four. Or maybe five. I don't know. Let's look. Melee four. And I'm going to flip a eight. You flip a 1, so that's going to put me at a 12 to your... 6. Okay, so... Yeah. Do you want to take it? you want to cheat? Yeah. Yeah, I do. B12. So you're at 10. It's different to 2. Oh, uh, do I have anything left? So that's a 7 then you're cheating with? So you're at a total of what, 12? Yeah. So it's negative negative then? Uh, and hard. That's why it's negative negative? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, sorry, negative, so one more. So still weak. Um, I have a ram on my dual total though, so it's going to be at 2 damage. I think that might kill him. He's dead. Okay. And I'll score me one for reckoning. And then it's just the lawyer, and he's going to try and beat him. Shun! Alright, so we're going to do objection you like crazy. Uh, first one, straight flip. I get a 10, which puts me at 16. Killer! Go for it! Okay, uh, so you're cheating to what? Nothing. No, it was a 2, so plus. Four or five. Okay, I'm gonna cheat with a book of seven, so it's thirteen six. total to your six, so I'm difference of seven, so it's a straight damage flip. And you take uh, poison. poison, that's right, and then it's gonna be two damage no matter what I flip. Two damage. Sixteen. 
Red Joker. Not a Red Joker. Okay, so that's going to be a total of 20 to your 10? Yes. Okay, so difference of 10. Um, I'm not going to cheat any higher. I'll make it a Ram, though. I'll show you a book, rather, so that you're poisoned again. Not that it really matters. Uh, you take two damage. And that's turn. So you take up another damage for her from the poison counter that comes off. Actually, you have four poison counters on you right now. So you have one more. Three, and the game will keep going on an 11 plus. Flip it, otherwise the game ends. No nope. schemes. Um, I managed to get one from Reconnoiter this turn. Sorry, not Reconnoiter, Reckoning this turn, because I killed two guys, puts me at four. Um, I did not get my other scheme though, although you guys saw me trying to do it every turn forever, which was assassination. And I almost got close a bunch of times. What was your other scheme? Uh, I had outflank and um, frame for murder. Frame for murder, that's right. Um, so sorry, I got, uh, oh no, I, I had frame for murder and outflank. I didn't have assassination, what am I talking about? Oh. We didn't have assassination in the pool. I had frame for murder and uh, outflank. And so yes, I don't think I got outflank because I am on the center line, but I'm not within three of the end. I score three from outflank because you revealed it and because you have a guy on Isaac. So six, four in the game. All right, so there you go, 50 soul stones, ending in a resurrectionist victory. Uh, definitely an upset from the last game. You totally own me on schemes. And drove me mad enough to try to kill Seamus over and over and over. It just didn't happen. Because I forgot I didn't have assassinate. <laughs> like, I honestly, I thought I had assassinate for most of the game, forgetting that I had frame for murder. Um, frame for murder earning me some points. Frame for murder actually earning you points as well. In hindsight, I should have put on the depleted. Because, like, it's a sacrificial land anyway. Like, I'm throwing it out there to die and explode. So if I frame it and you happen to kill it with Sabelle or something like that, I would have earned way more. Um, and actually, you almost killed it with your master. Because that's what I was running for. That would have been amazing. Yeah. I would have gotten three for it then. So what did you think about your second game? Like, you definitely played for the schemes this time around and completely kicked my teeth in. Uh, it was good. Uh, definitely baited him by putting Seamus right in yeah. front of him. And... Wasn't necessarily my intention. I was going to try to kill him with him, and it worked out really in my favor. Yep. Uh, playing for schemes really helped out a lot. Uh, well, he, he he occupied so much of my army in the side of the table while your other stuff scheme ran. Just, or you just went off the edges. Like, that's all you had to do. And you could just stand there. I had Illuminated who were supposed to be able to deal with stuff, but then Sabelle just made one into paint. <laughs> <laughs> and then the other one got greedy and tried to go after your punk zombie and didn't go after the corner, which is what he was supposed to be doing. So yeah, definitely a um, definitely an, uh, uh, a good, well-fought game, um, and I made some key mistakes. I, I went for your master when I probably should have been going for the schemes. And that's what happens in Alpha. If you don't go for the schemes, you end up just getting greedy and trying to play for a kill. It doesn't work. You bog me down, and then there was nothing I could do. I couldn't come back from um, the, the, the early scheme run and get into those corners. And holy crap, is he mobile. Yes, he is. Um, being able to... to to cheat him to moving 16 inches. Yeah. Um, as long as you keep him somewhere that he can just walk around the corner and disappear, good call. This table certainly helps. You can see like the whole Red Chapel thing, like being in the quarantine zone, everything is blocking terrain. So even the cover is blocking terrain. It would have been a little bit different if we were playing in the desert table that I sometimes use. And you'll probably have to get used to that because it's a lot more sparse. Yep. And you can't teleport to things like the clumps of bushes and stuff like that because they don't block, right? They're just, yep. they're just cover. So it makes him, um, he's not. He's definitely not quite as, like, just teleport around the map when he's not in a, a sort of dense urban environment like this. So it definitely shows, like, the table matters in Malfo and the scenery matters a lot, too. Yeah, definitely. Um, in fact, Leviticus might even be a better pull for you if that happens. That's a cool thing about Malfo is because you pick your army list after you know the terrain you're playing on, um, the schemes and strategies you're playing for, you can do that. You can just switch over to somebody else like Leviticus or, like, um... Who was it, McMorning or whoever? You yeah. have to pick the same guy all the time. Yeah. So that was it. That was another Under the Breach. I hope you enjoyed our Malfo series, um, and we will have lots more of it soon. We'll see you for more Malfo. Until then, we're